Okay, second year, I hope you're all keeping safe and healthy. Listen, I'm doing a video here now on the tangent to an ellipse, uh, tangent from an ellipse to a point. This is applicable for this question here. The line CD is a tangent to the from C, okay? So C is here. This is the ellipse. You have to show your workings, and there's a step by step guide on page 209 of your textbook. But I'm going to run through it now. This is different. So here we have an ellipse, right? I'm going to do my example on this. This is different to if we have an ellipse. Just to get this focus. Different to a tangent at an ellipse. So we've looked at before tangent at an ellipse like this. We go from the focal points through, we bisect the angle, then we get a tangent at an ellipse. This is from a point outside, okay? So from here, we can get a tangent that just touches, well, actually, in two, two places if we need to, right? So the method for this is as follows. Try and follow it, as I said, the steps in the book. So if I pick a point outside my ellipse here now, let's say here, a tangent from that point. Step one is set the compass to the nearest focal point from that point. All right, and do a big arc. This is all. I'm, I'm going too heavy here, same as my lips, just to show you, okay? Step one, from the point you're given, draw an arc through the focal point. Step two, step, set the compass at full major axes, okay? Full major axes there. Put the pin at the furthest focal point and get a crossover between this arc here and two places. Okay, I'll explain why in a second. Right, so you're doing a big arc there to get a crossover between the two arcs we've just done. Step three, draw a line from the crossover point of the two arcs to the furthest focal point away. This gives you the point of contact. This is our workings, right? So that's the point of contact. If I draw a line from the point, you'll see it just touches your lips at one point. That's my tangent to the ellipse there. It works in the other way as well. So if I go to this crossover point, to the furthest focal point, crosses the ellipse here, you'll see it gives you a nice tangent as well. Just touches at one point. You have to show these workings, so you have to memorize them steps. Okay? As I said, page. 209 in your textbook and you'll have this video to go by as well. So let's go back to the question that you're doing. From C, you find a focal point here, say. From C, put the pin here, nib here, you find your focal points like you normally do. Do an arc. Set the compass at full major axes. So it's compass at full major axes. Put the pin at the other focal point, get a crossover point. Right. Draw a line from the crossover point to the furthest. Right. This will give you a point of contact. From there, you draw a line to C. You don't need to do it here for this drawing. Okay. If you've got any other questions, make sure you email me or put it up in Google Classroom. You have to keep engaging. Okay. You have to keep going with the course. Okay. Goodbye for now.